Hey guys, Silence here, here. Welcome back to another Utama Cross Gacha video. Me, as you can see, we are not on the main page of Utama Cross as just yet, um, because there is this particular banner that I need to probably encourage you guys to probably support the game um, if you are planning to get singing stones for the upcoming gachas especially for the halloween events um, that's coming or currently going on um, as you can see they are selling 1800 yen for 500 singing stones which is a lot cheaper than normally what you'll pay um, for the amount of singing stones currently um, available in the singing stone shops so Let's take a look at the discounted rate. So 3,500 yen for 1,000 stones, which is pretty a lot. Alright, so it's a brand new day. That's why it's uh, loading all the banners that is available within the game. And of course, as you can see, I have received my first rarity up star. So that this video also will include uh, a know-how on how to use the rarity star up. Um, yeah, so... <laughs> I'm fumbling with my words, I'm ex extremely exhausted, so guys, bear with me. Um, this is a... Um, well, uh, I I'm going with no scripts, so guys, uh, just bear with me for a moment. So, alright, Rarity Upstar, we're gonna do that later on. I'm gonna choose one of the plates that I probably have, um, that is at 5 stars, that I wish to have to go up to 6 stars. Um, yeah, so, we are gonna talk about all these um, just a moment so guys we're gonna talk about the store for a moment because we're gonna talk about the banner that is of the discounted rate now there are only two um, packs that has the discounted rate and they have the expiration date right there so guys as of this video's recording there is another 10 more days that you actually can purchase this um, special discounted packs so 1,800 yen for 500 singing stones and of course they will give you the, um, the zodiac medals oh no no not zodiac medals sorry um, the current month's um, what do you call it stones or spheres um, that you can exchange for rare items that normally you will have to play events for that kind of thing and yeah of course 3,500 yen for 1,000 singing stones now if you look at the packs for the previous uh, quantities that they are discounting for this is 2,000 2, yen cheaper which is definitely worth getting you know um, so yeah it's a lot of money saved if you are the kind of person who has been spending for Utah Cross just like myself if you're buying the singing stones do take note you can use it for the current gachas if they are the uh, divas, they are, they are of your favorites. Um, if not, well, you can buy the pack now and save up for your upcoming favorite divas gacha. So, guys, that's pretty much my um, hint to you guys or um, knowledge to share with you guys regarding all these discounted packs. I have been purchasing every single discounted pack that has been released so far. So. Yeah, if not, I wouldn't be able to make these videos for you guys. <laughs> so, anyways, um, let's talk about the current gacha that's going on. Um, yeah, we want to take a look and see whether if it's actually worthwhile to pull for Makina's brand new episode plate. So, let's tap Makina's plate here. And, of course, we get to see a total of 3,345. Yeah focusing on charm so that's pretty much what you need to know about this current event you need episode plates which has high charm uh, and a bit of voice so maybe voice and charm that episode plates that support voice and charm are pretty much what you need for the high score challenge to beat your opponents in this current event all right so center skill units voice and charm is increased by 45 percent up which is a fantastic fantastic center skill 45 percent up is not the best quantity but it is under the mid range tier so with that in mind i think this play is pretty worthwhile to obtain but let's take a look at its active skill and life skill to see whether it is fully uh um advisable to actually toss in your entire stash of seeing stones just for this play all right so active skill for 10 seconds, your score is boosted by 100% up. So immediately, with this active skill um, there, you know your singing stones are definitely worth 
um, getting this episode played. 100% um, boost in score for active skill is pretty normal, you know, and 10 second duration is a very long time as well. Um, there are, well, live skill supports that actually have a longer duration, but of course, uh, at a lower score percentage boost, um, probably 80%. Alright, live skill at the 50 second mark, well, for 12 seconds, you will have mm, an easier time tapping notes. So, um, the live skill itself is pretty fantastic when it comes to um, probably getting perfect full combos or full combos. So, Makina's plate is both useful as a high score and a live skill support. So, in this case, these Plate, this particular plate for Makina is a must get. Okay, so <laughs> definitely a hundred percent must obtain episode plate. Um, probably one of the better episode plates with skills or slotted on a plate itself. Um, yeah. So sadly to say, no notes attached to it. But with skills like those, I think having the notes. I mean, no notes available on this episode plate is pretty uh, awesome itself already. So guys, I would still highly recommend you to pull this gacha to obtain Makina's episode plate. Even if it's not fully evolved, getting its 5 star episode plate is still a very very important thing. Um, especially when it comes to future play. Because right now, even though its total score is on the mid tier level, the skills alone outweigh all the stats. So guys, we're gonna do the pool. Hopefully I'll obtain this plate, then I can probably evolve it with the rarity up star for you guys to take a look. But before that, let's take a look at the rest of the episode plates available in Makina's brand new gacha. Uh, of course, we want this as well. I mean, if you're a Kaname fan, this plate is awesome. If you're a professional or rather a hardcore Utah Macross player, this plate is definitely worth getting because of its special note at the end. Right. So then the other thing is probably the exclusive plate within this um, Gacha banner which is Freya's Halloween version. So all the Freya fans will definitely want to try and obtain this plate even though it is a 5 star max evolution. Alright so I'm gonna do a 10 plate pull because I only have enough singing stones as of yet. I have not purchased the discounted packs so who knows um, I might be keeping the those singing stones for the future gachas. Um, I definitely wish to get Makina's plate. Um, probably might do single pulls if I do not get the plate from the 10 pool. But you know, or maybe in the future when the plate comes back as a returning gacha banner. Oh well. Let's see. Alright, here we go, guys. We're gonna do this very quickly now. So one, two, three, no, four, five, okay, so that we're looking pretty grim on the terms, oh, there's no red boxes. So we definitely won't be pulling a five star episode plates unless the goddesses of luck really blesses me with it. But from the looks of it, I don't think so. Let's keep moving. Alright, second red box, so no exclusive plate yet, so these are all pretty much duplicates. Um, yeah, so guys, it's okay if you don't get Makina's plate, I mean after all her costume is unlockable with the episode plates from the event itself. Alright, so we do get a lot of Macross 7 love right here, so, ah, uh, that's kind of sad. Okay, so, uh, I do no I do notice that um, within Twitter itself, a lot of the Japanese players have pretty bad luck on this banner. So if you guys actually obtain Makina's um, episode plate from the gacha itself, you'll, co you'll probably consider yourself very very lucky because I do follow a lot of Japanese tw uh, players on Twitter and from the looks of it, out of maybe 10, only one or two of them have probably obtained Makina's episode plate. So guys, if you do obtain Makina's plate, you know, by luck, um, yeah. Um, bless your. I mean, thank the gods, whoever you worship, um, because this episode plate is very, very awesome, and it is pretty hard to obtain, 
strangely enough, even though that the percentage drop rate for the plate is pretty much the same for every banner um, that is brand new. So yeah. Um, all right, guys. So I'm gonna head over to my episode plate list. We're gonna take a look at what um, fantastic episode plates I have on hand that requires evolving. So guys, let's take a look. I'm gonna take a look at all the five star episode plates. Okay, we're gonna scroll down. I do have this recently obtained, um, yeah, Meline's birthday plate, but considering its skills, it's not that fantastic, even though it does have a very good life skill support, um, which I probably can use for this current event. Um, so, hmm, and it is. An episode plate that is focusing charm and voice. So I probably could use uh, Meline's plate to help um, get the high score bonus, I suppose. But you know, looking at it, okay, so apparently my rare up star doesn't evolve a 5 star to a 6 star plate. So that's pretty strange. I guess maybe mine is more to a 4 to 5. Huh, let's take a look. Oh no, no. This plate is fully evolved already. <laughs> so I guess we need to find a plate that is not evolved yet. So let's go. Um probably Makinas. Uh no Makina Mikumo. Oh Okay, I have not unlocked it all the way, so I guess I can do this. Let's take a look. Ah, huh, that's strange. Do I even have the rarity up star? Oh, that's weird. Let me just check through again. Okay, it's not indicated here. That's strange. Okay, so... Hmm... We're gonna try evolving Meline's episode plate here. Alright, we're gonna tap this. There we go, poop. So with the rarity up star, I managed to evolve Meline's plate fully. And here we go, I do have enough points um, to unlock her costume as well. So I guess that's fantastic. So guys, I just shown you an example on how to use the rarity up star. Even though the line Connecting to the Rarity Up Star logo is not there. Um, it is still possible to use it. Uh, it's funny that it's not indicated in the item list um, when it comes to the Rarity Up Star. So you don't really know whether you have it on hand or not, um, which is pretty strange. Um, it, they should have probably indicated it with the lighted blue lines like you see here that you have enough materials to evolve the plate. You know, so I, I don't know, it's pretty strange. Anyway guys, um, I'm gonna power this up to unlock Meline's costume so I guess you guys can see a costume animation. So there we go, so I finally unlocked Meline's birthday costume. It took a while, but I think it's fine. Um, I wasn't really in a hurry to obtain it, so I guess that's okay. Uh, anyway guys, that's pretty much all the info I have. Um, I'm, I apologize for such a impromptu video um, and all the fumbling of words and all this because it is pretty late for me. It's like 11.20 a.m. Uh, no, not a.m. P.m. Uh, and I've just gone through like a three-day uh, continuous chaotic work shift. Um, yeah, and I'm very exhausted, guys. So that's probably one of the reasons why this video is really not put together well enough. <laughs> anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching as always, hopefully you found whatever I mumbled out in informative <laughs> uh, to you guys. Uh, hopefully you guys have better luck getting Makina's episode plate than I do. 
Um, I'm gonna try again, probably, um, you know, after I purchase the packs. Um, yeah, hopefully I obtain Makina's episode plate. Um, I think there is another episode plate coming along this brand, if I'm not wrong. Um, probably Basara's costume because Uta Macross official Twitter has been promoting the Basara's costume, the werewolf costume um, on its Twitter with the contest and all this. So yeah guys, uh, po probably we might see Basara's costume um, in the second gacha banner I guess. So Basara fans, if you guys have bought the uh, discounted packs or uh, yeah, if not you've been saving up enough singing stones you definitely want to obtain Basara's brand new costume if it comes around um, within this current event itself anyway guys thank you guys for staying until the rest of the video i'll see you guys in the next ultra macross gacha video until then bye bye